Hey everyone! Today I want to show you how to create an affiliate store on Amazon from start to finish. Let's go! First, let's go to Amazon Associates and create your store there. Click Sign up and then follow the steps. The system will ask you to provide billing information, your phone number and so on. Then, you will be asked to list resources where you want to showcase your recommendations. Since we're building a website, I will only mention the website, but you can of course list more platforms, for example, your social media. We will create the website using Spread Simple. It's an easy-to-use website builder that allows you to create online stores, including affiliate stores, in literal minutes. If you don't have an account already, use your Google account to sign up and then find the affiliate template in the dashboard. I will now quickly publish the website to get an URL and after I'm done with the Amazon setup, I will come back and edit the website and fill it with my content. Okay, so for now, don't pay attention to any of the website's content, just publish the website and copy the URL and paste it into the Amazon setup and then proceed. Fill in the rest of the fields and describe the purpose of your affiliate store and the details of your platform. For example, I'm going to create a website with skincare recommendations and I'm going to pick the niche website option. Okay, now let's finalize with the Amazon and get to the interesting part. So now that my store is ready and here it's ID. Now let's go find the products that we want to recommend. So once you open the page with the product that you want to recommend, check the upper part of the screen and you'll see the side stripe banner and get link button on the right. Click that button to get your personalized affiliate link and copy it. And now let's go back to Spread Simple, find the website that we just created here, uh, click edit and then find the button edit Google Sheet and go to the Google Sheet. So this uh, Google Sheet is our content management system. Whatever is here on Google Sheet will appear on the website. And for now, it's the template content, which we will replace. So first, let's go ahead and paste the Amazon link here for the product that I just chose. And here we can actually leave just one column for link. Uh, if you're working with Amazon, because they have this new uh, banner on top where you can just easily get the link from. But if you're working with some other uh, affiliate program that operates more through referral codes that you need to manually add to the link, we have a formula set up here that you can use. Uh, for now, I'm just gonna delete one of these columns and create just the regular link column and paste my link here. Okay, now let's go ahead and fill the rest of the columns for our product. I'm gonna change the category and now I'm gonna just fill in the name and the price of the product that I chose. remove the old price section. I'm just gonna copy the description and paste it in the full description column. You can edit it for markdown if you want it to look pretty on your website. And for the short description, I'm just gonna write my own recommendation. And I'm gonna, for now, remove the related products. I'm gonna add the rating and leave the bestseller for this product at the discount that's shown on Amazon. And I will delete the columns that I do not need for my store. This is a setup for a tech affiliate store, which I don't need. Okay, now let's add images. I'm gonna just save images from Amazon, but of course it's better if you make your own pictures. It will look more trustable and overall more personalized. 
I'm gonna use the Spread Simple Image Uploader to host the images and just get links for them to add them in the spreadsheet. There we go. Okay, I'm just adding the link and and now we can go back, hit the refresh button or the changes to show on the website. Now let's see, and here's the product that I just added among all the tech products on this uh, template. Let's check if the link works. Here it is. Let's find my I Amazon ID here in the link to make sure that it's actually an affiliate link. And here it is. Okay, and now we can go back to the website editor and fix the design and the name and everything. So let's go to the design tab and find the homepage intro section and write the, our website's name or our project's name and a short description. I'm just gonna quickly write that these are my favorite skincare products. And now we can change the head image. You can add your own images if you have any, or you can uh, use the stock images that are automatically added to the website editor. I like this one. So it already looks better. And now let's go ahead and add a couple of more products for the website to look more complete. I'm just gonna fast forward this uh, process or it, you can change the speed to see how I'm adding the product info to the spreadsheet. I'm doing everything that I did with the first product. I just want the website to look more full for you to see how things work. Okay, and here we go. We again refresh, hit the refresh button for everything to be saved and shown on the website. And we have our freshly added products on the website. And now let's just fix the look of it. I'm gonna use a different layout and fix the colors of the buttons because I don't think it's giving skincare now. I'm just gonna use pink and change the text on the bottom. On the button you can customize everything here as you can see in the options. For now I want to just show a quick setup that's why I'm not going through every single option that there is and on the product page here you can see the big description that we copied from Amazon of course it's always better to write your own description okay now it looks all much better and this is it now we can uh, save the changes publish them again and see the website it's ready to share I hope that you find this video useful. Let us know in the comments if you have any questions or if you've already created a website with Spread Simple. We would like to see those websites. And that's it for today. Good luck!